My boyfriend Gary and I have been together for three years. He's a certified nursing assistant and he spends his spare time playing video games. So, how did I meet Gary? That's a good one. You see, Gary graduated high school with my older brother, Sean, who's in Iraq now. One day, when I was in 10th grade, Gary called the house looking for Sean, and guess who answered? Hello? Is Sean home? Nope, he's out shooting squirrels. Amber? Gary? Amber, who are you talking to? It's Gary. What does he want? Mom, Dad, and my brother were not too happy when I started dating Gary. Yeah, you're still a little baby to me, Amber. So you can imagine the reaction when I laid this one on him. I'm pregnant. Is that comfy? Yeah. And it's springy. Sit. Oh, um. Sit. Come on through. Hold on. Sit. There was something I was going to ask you. What do you mean? Huh? What do you mean? What do you mean? I was wondering if you would marry me. No. You did not. Yeah. Oh, baby. I hope it fits me. My fingers are swollen. I'll fit. <laughs> I mean, I want to ask your dad before we actually, you know, get married, but I don't know if you want to marry me. Mm -hmm. I know we fight, but everybody does. And I know with us having a baby and everything, we need to have a complete family. I want to be there for both of you guys, so. Simon? Yeah. I love you so much, huh? I am the happiest girl in the whole world. Is everybody ready? Yeah, we're ready. Okay, you got a contraction? Push down hard into your bottom. Good job. Keep going, come on. Oh, yeah. Come on, great. come on, you're moving right there. Oh, great. You're doing great. Push. Give me that baby. Let's see. Okay, good, 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 good. Oh, wow. She's again, right again. Big breath and push, push hard. Beautiful. There's a bunch of black hair. And I need you to give me a huge push. Sit. A long sit. Push. Sit, Eddie. Oh, oh, oh. It's a girl. Oh, so pretty. Yeah. She looks like me. <laughs> Does she come with any instructions? I found a motel that I can afford, so I'm taking Leah with me. I'm gonna be at the H&K Motel. Right now I have a week set up. <laughs> so where's her other pack and play? Back in the van. I need you to unlock your van. When, when I bring it down there, I'll grab it for you. All right, well then come on, because I'm ready to go then. Thank you. 
Amber, I seem happier here. Hell yeah. Your Uncle David was talking about getting married. That's not up to me. I'm more fashion when it comes to that. Hmm. Are you asking me if I would say yes? I already know what you'd say. You don't know. I like get engaged. Yeah, I don't like that. You don't like get engaged. I want you to put thought behind it. And it <laughs> it's funny, but and if you want your old ring back, you can have it back. The one that we lost, the original engagement ring. I got it in my pocket if you want it. <laughs> I don't understand. I was going to ask you to marry me, you know, like to engage, to get married. You could wear that if you wanted. I just don't have, you know. Well, if that's the case, this is a real ring that won't. I didn't pay for that. You don't have to pay for it, <laughs> Gary. I okay, told this you. Is, you bought this, though. That's different. A ring is a ring. All right. I know we've been through a lot, but do you want to marry me again? Gary, don't say it like that. All right. Do you want to marry me? It's not do you want to. It is do you want to. Will you? Okay, I'm sorry. I'll say it the way, exact way you want it to. It's not that. I, I don't hear it from your heart. That's from my heart. I just did it so many times. Really, Gary? Twice. Then if it doesn't mean anything does, to you, then don't want do to, it. But I said do you want to. You look Will very you? uncomfortable right now. There's water coming up here. Amber, oh my lord. I said, do you want to marry me? I didn't know how to say, will you? What's the difference? Oh my god. Amber, will you marry me? I promise you're gonna be there for me and not run out on me all the time? Yes. I don't wanna run out on you. Say, will you marry me? Yeah. Forever? Yeah. I'm gonna give you your ring back. That you just gave me. No, if I didn't have Leo, we would not be together. And then why are we together now? I don't know. I just want a real guy to marry. <clears throat> I'll get my stuff, don't worry. You're not moving fast enough. Come on, Gary, you're moving slow. You need to go. Amber. Pick something up, get on going. All right, Amber. Gary and I have been apart for three months, but I agreed to talk things over with him, and I want to give him my full attention, so we're dropping Leah off at the babysitter. Hi, Leah, what are you doing? Thank you, guys. All righty. Have a seat, hon. Thank you. There you go. I've matured in my own ways, like, because I've missed you so much. You need to win that back. Like, I just don't even know what to expect, and I'm scared to get hurt. Do you think we need some counseling to help with that? It's going to help us communicate a little better. I want to open up my heart to you all the way. Do you? You can't be talking to him anymore. Like, do you really want to be with me? Yeah. I want to be with you forever. I want my family. I need you, Amber. I'm really scared. Like, let's just toying with Leah. Mommy and Daddy's back together again. Oh, they're breaking up again. Like, I think that we have so much we need to get past first. I agree. After everything that's happened between me and Gary, I'm not sure if I'm ready to try again. So what's going on between you two? I haven't seen you in a while, so. We went with that at a house for us to be together in, and I hope it's going to be good, you know? It's going to be good. It's going to be great. So where does that put you guys on working things out? I worry about you all fight. The thing that we thought about the most was the past, and there's no reason to keep talking about it. You can't fix what's in the past, exactly. you just fix the future. Leah needs to have a stable family. When we fight, she starts crying, she hated it. Yeah, she hated it. And she started hitting us. <laughs> She's not you may not think, think that it affects her, but if you think about what you used to tell me about your own childhood when your parents would argue, you remember things that you didn't think you would remember. Yeah. So you know that. You don't want her to grow hating us. Mm. Well, Grandma's glad to hear that. Mm. Uh oh, mommy and dad kissing. Like, yeah, that's right. Mm. Yay! <laughs> Andrew's watching Leah. Let's go. So Gary and I can see each other and have our therapy session. Oh my god, dude, that just pisses me off that we can't be around her together. All right, so Amber, what would you like to get out of this? Trust and reconnection. 
Okay. For him to understand that I'm a different person than what he remembers. Mm. How do you think that you've changed? And what do you think is important I don't that know. Gary knows? I, I think that my attitude, the way I act, and um, uh, my anger. Just knowing that Amber is sober, how much does that reduce the level to which you're concerned about what's going on? I'm very happy with that. Whatever she gets worked out for her, I think it needs to be maintained and taken on time at the same time. I had a lot of problems with that, taking my medication on time. And okay, I don't so want time. Her to That's why it says substance abuse. My thing, I didn't take my medication on time at all. So do you feel like you're more self-aware now yeah. of what's good for you? Yeah, now I know. Wh I never knew before. It, now from this point forward, can we acknowledge moving forward you're going to do your best to communicate better, to be honest with each other, to respect each other, and respect the commitment that you've made to each other? Is that something you can both own up to and commit to? I can. I want to be with Amber. I've always wanted to be with Amber. Mm -hmm. I love her with all my heart. I do. I love you with all my heart. As of now, I don't have custody of my daughter Leah. And since Gary is in a new relationship, it makes dealing with him harder. What's up, Portwood? What's Uski doing? We're just sorting through some coins here. Yeah. Can we go Yep, here's Mommy on the phone, honey. Hey, Mommy. Hi, beautiful. You want to come to my house? Yeah. You can come get me right now. All right. I love you. I'll be on my way to get you. Okay, bye. Can I go look out? Look out the window. I gotta go to my mom. I'm just living so fancy free. I ain't worried about a damn thing. It's who I am. Is that her in the window? Give me a hug, give me a kiss. I got some medicine for her. Why? Infection in her ear. One teaspoon of this. Is there instructions on the bottle? Um, I'll call you tonight and just tell you to walk you through it. Why would you need to walk me through it? Because it's like rocket science. It's literally science Take right one teaspoon full by mouth every day. Have a hug. Come here. Make sure you gotta take them. You gotta take them all. Give me a kiss. This is a big house for such one person. Yeah. You know, you live here by yourself, just making sure you're okay. Oh. I feel like we don't fight no more. It's kind of nice. Well, when you listen to him and you don't cut me off, it's very, very nice, and it makes for a nice conversation. Why are you saying that? Because you you cut me off. Like when I when I remind you stuff about Leah, you don't, and you get mad at me because I'm. Sometimes like, I know. I'm just saying. You were gone, year and a half in prison, and there's a lot of stuff that I had to do. I know what you did. Don't make it about <laughs> Aunt <Amber> or Christina. <laughs> I need to talk to your mom. For why? Is that cool? I talk to you for no, a second? No, for why? Just because we're filming doesn't mean we need to do all this. Well, I just want to tell you something before you hear it from Leah. Um, so you, you're aware. <gasps> oh, I love you so much. Are you and Christina getting married or something? No. Oh, then what is Not it? Not for a while, if ever, but it's, it, I'm having a baby. So, uh, Christina's pregnant, and before Leah said anything, I wanted to tell you. Oh, my God. So Leah's going to have a little brother or sister. Oh, Jesus. You have fun with that. Okay, mm -hmm. well, I just wanted you to be aware. Well, that's weird for you to say that and then be like, we're not going to get married, if ever. Like, what is, that's just weird to say. Either baby doesn't mean you get married. You're supposed to get married and then have babies. You know that, right? Yeah. Well, I mean, the thing is, is like you have to that... think about her feelings when you say things because, like, this is on national television. If you say oh, something wow, like, that's fine. Well, hold on, that's hold true. on, hold on, hold on. If you say something like, we're not gonna get married if ever, and then you tell me she's pregnant, like, where's your head at? Get Where it, it needs to be. It's right here. <laughs> You no, seriously, be, like, if I, about, like, I told her the same thing today. Well, I am thinking about that, but together. I'm making sure it's right first. Just like, it, obviously, a lead didn't keep us together, so. That closes that door so good. You guys could chat or? What are we chatting about? Whatever you want to chat about, Leah and girl stuff, I guess, getting your pedicures or? I'm just going to end up, like, talking all the smack about you to her. And so be it. And ask her if you're still doing half the stuff you used to do. Yeah. <laughs> ask away. Bunny. 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 Boop, 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 boop.
You guys need to go get Lee from school. Oh my God, it is freaking hot. How did you and Gary, like, I seen your ex, he's, he's not bad looking. Like what happened there? Like, <laughs> like honestly. I don't know. You though, like you can tell you love each other. And you know, it's like, I think he needs to warm up to the fact of me bringing her to school and stuff. And she wants that. She said that to me. We're working on him. And he has, there's nothing, I mean, did anything. Like I shouldn't prove it. I don't, I don't have anything to yeah. prove to him anymore. I really don't. And I always tell him, do it for Leah, you know? Everything's getting better, but he still gets on my nerves. Still some work in that category. I'm still in LA and I'm really excited because I asked Gary to bring Leah out here to visit for the weekend. How's my hair, babe? It's gorgeous. Yeah, it's that midlife, just had a baby crisis. <laughs> Waking up. Come in. Hi, baby. You guys got stuck in traffic? You got detour everywhere around here. Oh, God. What's up, guys? <gasps> oh, he's up now. Mm. Give him a kiss. Oh, he's got big. He feels good. Love you. Oh, what's in me? Stay You're pushing me down. Stop. Ready? I'm yeah. not on you. Hi. Make it, baby. Make it, yes. baby. He's got it. He's out. Jesus. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> what do you think about doing a girls' day with yeah. Leah and I? Maybe get a Manny and Petty. Oh, nice. Yeah. Where at? I'm going. Yeah. No, you're not. <laughs> I was also thinking I could watch the baby for the night if you guys want a night off. Listen, if, if you really want to, I definitely could use a night of sleep. If you want to babysit James tomorrow, I'd love that too. Yeah. No? <laughs> Hear that, baby? We're getting a night off. Yeah. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> Get over here. <laughs> 